Welcome to the Bellevue Garlic Test Kitchen uh, where today we will be testing out my theories to how best to achieve the famous 10 second garlic peeling exercise. My theory is that actually if you have a garlic with a head on it, um, with, a, with a stalk coming out of it, it probably worked better but it'll also hurt like hell and actually I'm not really sure how we're going to get rid of the bottom hard bit that kind of binds all the cloves together. So anyway we'll give it a go, one with a stalk and one without the stalk and we'll just see what happens. Okay so here we are with clover or a head of garlic with no stalk coming out of it and I will just smash it and see how we go. Well that doesn't work. Oh, hey, it's gone everywhere. Okay, now we take this, peel it apart somehow, throw it in here, and as the guy says, shake the diggings out of it for about 10 seconds. One, kind of two, three and a half out of seven or eight. So 50% um, success rate on that one. Um, we'll try the next one. Okay, so now time for our second test. Here's one with a stalk. Um, this is really hard and I think this is going to kill my hand if I try it. So I'm going to enlist the help of this trusty metal bowl and um, see if this works. One, two, three. No, uh, kind of, but not real. <laughs> nah. And then we shake the crap out of it for about 10 seconds. Two, three, four, five. Out of uh, about eight or nine. So we're batting about 500 on both of these. And uh, I think this will have to be put down to operator error. I think it's basically unproven as to whether this will work or not. But anyway. There you go.